remember back in, what was it, 1993, had a Thanksgiving of a lifetime. Showed up there, I had a bootlegger uh, whiskey or something like I can't remember what the hell it was because I was already fucked the hell before I bought it. Had bootlegger whiskey and I bought a trash bag of mashed potatoes because I didn't have a big enough bowl to put the potatoes in. So Uncle Arnie was there. Of course, he was pissed off. He said, what the hell is this? I slammed the bag on the table and the potatoes blow all over the kitchen, all over the whole family. Now, that was the first accident I had uh, during the family gathering. But the second accident, uh, it wasn't actually my accident. Uh, some, some drunk bimbo rammed his car into the side of the house and the guy went flying through the mashed potatoes and his head got stuck in the turkey. And uh, Uncle Arnie fucking fell backwards and he split his stomach open on the electric saw. The <laughs> that thing, it's on auto autopilot. And once it starts cutting, I mean, it's a turkey cutter, so it'll fucking saw your stomach open. Luckily, the ambulance was right behind the guy who crashed into the side of the house. Took Uncle Arnie to the hospital, sewed him up real quick, and he was actually back in time for dinner. That was a crazy Thanksgiving if I ever did see it, but luckily the ambulance uh, scraped the guy who got shot out through the windshield uh, pronto. I, they said, sorry about this. I said, well, it is the holidays. <laughs> it's not a surprise to me, but sure. Thanksgiving, well, sure, it's a time to give, but it's also a time to take, which is uh, what the Indians experience. They got the, their souls taken from them and uh, their bodies also taken from them. And uh, when I go to the grocery stores, people like to take the yams from me. I don't, I don't know when the hell the best time is to go to the store to buy uh, a bag of yams because the last three years that I went there to the store, there's about two moldy ones left. What the fuck am I supposed to do with two moldy yams? I mean, what the hell am I supposed to do? So I think I'm going to get Brussels sprouts and I'm going to get a big cabbage. I'm going to actually uh, rent it a chainsaw. I'm going to saw that fucker in half and just toss it in the oven with a human pig. And I'll roast that for about three to four hours at about 500 uh, and up, which would be broiling. So that should be an interesting Thanksgiving. Hopefully no one crashes in the side of the house this year. The fuck was that? Of course, it's a squirrel. Hey, squirrel. Get the fuck out of here. Black Friday is really starting to piss me off. I'll tell you why. I've never seen so many children get stomped on in all my life. You got the mother, she can't get a sitter. You know, you go to Walmart to check out the deals and boy, is there a deal. The deal is as soon as you walk in the door, if you don't run faster than you ever have, you're going to get crushed by a 500 pound fucking walrus trying to get the 60 inch TV for $200. That's going to break in about two months. And your child's going to have brain damage for the rest of his life. That's why I don't like Black Friday. All right, guys. Well, that's enough for me. If you have any Thanksgiving stories, feel free to just comment below. Let me know what your stories are. And I'll talk to you. Well, a little later, huh?